This view needs no introduction whatsoever. Well, in those that don't know, anyway, that's Table Mountain. And uh, to the to the right is Lion's Head. And over here, that is called Signal Hill. And in the far distance, if you can make it out, is the Cape Town Stadium and Robin Island in the far distance. And this uh, is the CBD of Cape Town at the pillar. And this is known as the Cape Town City Bowl, due to the fact it's like a bowl, uh, the shape, um, nestled between the mountains. And uh, over here is the V&A waterfront, it's very popular with tourists. And of course there's the harbour, which is called Duncan Dock. And this is basically the beginning of the Atlantic. Uh, seaboard which goes all the way up the west coast of Africa yeah all the way to the top uh, of uh, Morocco so we're just taking a leisurely walk um, which is closed off to traffic uh, due to its conditions it's all caving in and rock falls and what have you but it's a beautiful day um, so I'm making the best of it. Anyway, I'll leave you with those thoughts. Evidently, a little rock slide here with a stream coming through it. While continuing this uh, stroll, which is, yeah, getting a bit long now, just came across this. Never seen this before. In fact, I've never walked this far. So, yeah. There's a couple of guns here facing the, the ocean, which, of course, a majority majority of the area on the foreshore is reclaimed land so the actual sea the ocean came up to I'm trying to do this with a bit difficult to point <laughs> uh, cannot do this with a zoom pointing unfortunately but Basically, the top of the screen now is where the ocean used to be. Whereas now, if you follow the top of the screen, that's all reclaimed land. So, during the English British campaign of taking over from the Dutch in the 17 1800s, those guns were obviously to ward off any enemy coming ashore. Interesting. As this uh, stroll uh, comes to an end, literally, uh, you can see the areas below. Uh, 
basically this area here is the northern suburbs of Cape Town of course that's the Atlantic snaking its way all the way around to the top of Africa up the west coast and lion's head in the distance been a very nice walk been a bit of a puff today because uh, obviously need exercise but uh, yeah I think this is as far as we're going to take it today um, it's uh, pretty pretty warm today in fact uh, it's in the 20s uh, I'd say probably about 22 23 and yeah, um, we've, we're coming into the season of spring, end of month. So yeah, it's going, getting out of the winter now and uh, have to climatize to the new warmth. Hence the walk today. So in the far distance, You'll see the Cape Town area snaking its way to the south, which is the southern suburbs. And as I say, in, your, in the distance there is all the northern uh, suburbs of Cape Town. Yeah, and across those mountains is the hinterland going towards the north of South Africa and towards the east anyway guys thanks so much hope this is interesting if you wouldn't mind liking and subscribe possibly even share that would be appreciated okay cheers guys This view needs no introduction whatsoever. Well, in those that don't know, anyway, that's Table Mountain. And uh, to, the, to the right is Lion's Head. And over here, that is called Signal Hill. And in the far distance, if you can make it out, is the Cape Town Stadium and Robin Island in the far distance. And this uh, is the CBD of Cape Town at the Billa. And this is known as the Cape Town City Bowl. Due to the fact it's like a bowl, uh, the shape. Um, nestled between the mountains. And uh, over here is the V&A waterfront. It's very popular with tourists. And of course there's the harbour which is called Duncan Dock. And this is basically the beginning of the Atlantic uh, seaboard, which goes all the way up the west coast of Africa. Yeah, all the way to the top uh, of uh, Morocco. So we're just taking a leisurely walk, um, which is closed off to traffic uh, due to its conditions. It's all caving in and rock falls and what have you. But it's a beautiful day, um, so I'm making the best of it. Anyway, I'll leave you with those thoughts.